is important to whitelist the domain you are sending emails with. Whitelisting your domain will tell ISPs such as Gmail, Hotmail, and Yahoo that the third-party SMTP service sending the email is authenticated to do so, resulting in higher inbox rates and avoiding having your emails end up in spam. Whitelisting a domain for email sending is actually very easy. In your tier cloud account under SMTP, you will find a tab for whitelisting domains. Open it and add the domain you want to email with. If you plan on sending emails from promotions at yourstore.com, you will enter yourstore.com in this field. I will be using one of my own domains for this example. Click on the Add Whitelisted Domain button. Once added, you will see a SPF and DKIM record created. What is SPF and DKIM? They are both effective email signatures used in preventing spoofing, phishing, and impersonation. When a recipient received your email, their spam filter automatically pokes your domain to see if the DKIM and SPF signatures are there. If the spam filter sees you have the proper SPF and DKIM signatures, it will know that you are authenticated to send emails with this domain and not mark the emails as spam. To add the SPF and DKIM signatures to your domain, follow these steps. In this example, I will be using the popular cPanel to add the two signatures. Depending on where your domain is hosted, such as GoDaddy, your interface might look slightly different, but the information being added is the same. Scroll down in your cPanel to the icon named Advanced DNS Zone Editor. Open the page to add your SPF and DKIM records. Select your domain from the drop-down menu. Let's start by adding your SPF record. The name row is the first row shown in your tier cloud dashboard. You can add this record with or without the period at the end. Make sure there are no unnecessary spaces when adding your name. The second entry is your TTL. Copy and paste that. The type for both SPF and DKIM records are text, so we will go ahead and select that. The last thing to add is the text data, which is the bold text starting with V equals SPF1. Highlight it and paste it. Make sure there are no unnecessary spaces left in any of your entries. Go ahead and click Add Record. Your domain now has the proper SPF record to be authorized with sending emails from Tier Cloud. Let's do the same thing for your DKIM record. Your domain now has the proper SPF and DKIM records to ensure higher inbox rates when using TierCloud SMTP. These changes may take between 15 minutes to 2 hours to fully propagate and take effect. For any additional questions about whitelisting your domain, don't hesitate to create a support ticket in your TierCloud dashboard. If you found this tutorial useful, make sure to hit that like button. Subscribe to our channel to keep updated on our weekly marketing tutorials. Check out some of our other videos and be sure to leave a comment if you have any questions or video requests.